Hello, Breezy Bunch. Happy Friday. Hi, hello. It's the weekend. I'm so excited. Do you guys have any fun plans this weekend? Let me know in the comment section down below. So we have a Foodie Beauty community post update. I'm sorry it was from 12 hours ago, but these are the options we have to choose from to watch her make and eat tonight. So she says, hi, a salam. Just wondering if you all can help me decide what to make for dinner tonight and for my video. Please vote and thanks in advance. Our options are homemade crunch wrap and Mexican rice, spaghetti and meatballs with a parm mountain, homemade Big Macs and curly fries. Why can't she have a healthy option on here? Why? Why is it all junk food? Okay, I'm going to press something just to see, just to see what everybody's voting for. I guess we'll do, I'm assuming she's going to go with homemade Big Macs and curly fries. So let's click on that. That one has 45%. Okay. All right. Let's get to these comments. Let's go to newest first and off we go. Um, Deline said, love your video, Chantel. Thanks. German princess said, celery juice and a walk. I'm going to like that. Oh, okay. Jordan said, can you make block, block? I can't talk. I just literally sounded like a chicken. Can you make baklava from scratch and boric? Baklava is so good. Velvet Brown said, can you make black pudding and potted duck? Do they have duck in Kuwait? Or an, oh, that sounds so gross to me. No offense if you eat duck. Uh, Velvet continues, or a nice breakfast of poached duck eggs, pancetta, black pudding and rye bread. So many possibilities and wonderful recommendations by other viewers as well. Can't wait. Happy cooking. I really don't want to see her eat a duck. Uh, Fruit Salad said anything vegan. I'm liking that. Lauren said, please do Mexican rice. I'd love to learn how to make it. Lauren, you can literally search up any other video right now and they will make it way better than Foodie Beauty. I promise you. Black Velvet said, there is this great dish called just, oh, that's what they said. And then they continued, we would love to watch you make it happen. Wow. Aaron said, this is wild behavior, to be honest. Yeah, I wouldn't personally have said that, but I'm moving on. Uh, Ginger said, anything will be good, but Mexican food is always good. That's true. Mexican food really is always good. I'm like a chips and salsa with some cheese enchiladas or spinach enchiladas. Ooh, that sounds so good right now. Um, pa asked, did you hear about Karate Joe? So I didn't want to make a video covering it, but apparently, um, Karate Joe passed away and people are like trolls are going on his obituary and writing comments. Um, whew, how do I word this? I don't agree with leaving reviews or fake stories on an obituary um, because he still has family who probably had nothing to do with what he did. And um, I try to remember that. Does that make sense, you guys? Um, what he did and what he was accused of and he was on a register, a registry, um, I have nothing nice to say at all about Karate Joe, but can we think beyond that and think he has family who had nothing to do with his behavior? And like, I don't know. I also think leaving um, comments, joking around about how he was to you as a child, leaving these troll accounts, um, it takes away from the victims that were actually harmed by Karate Joe. So those are my thoughts. I'm curious if Foodie Beauty is going to address it at all. Remember, Foodie Beauty said she missed Karate Joe. Let that sink in. Um, Lady Motion said fasting and sport. Well, supposedly she's fasting, but I'm not buying that. Um, Se said go raw vegan. Woohoo! Sykes said church basement spaghetti again. I don't feel like it. Aaron said why can't it be anything healthy, or a dish from Kuwait? You don't really try anything new. I'm gonna like that. Um, is said Parm Mountain. Samuel said a Parm Mountain. Yes. Hayo said spaghetti or crunch wrap. I'm so sick of spaghetti. Can we do something different than spaghetti? 
Um, DG said, I could see why you call yourself lazy. And you should have added idiot to it. What? Am I missing something? Okay, let's go on. The cat box said, I'm always down for spaghetti. Whichever wins, though. Stacy G said, I'm tied with the Big Mac or the Crunch Wrap. I'm not tied. Like, I definitely don't want to see any of these options. <laughs> what about you guys? Can we make, like, a salad? I don't know. Um, HH said, homemade paneer. Juicer said, homemade Big Mac sounds so good. Mashallah? Masha Let's eat. Yalla. Okay. Cucumber said, what's a salam? Let's see. One of her sock accounts replied, it means peace be upon you. And then um, she says the words and she says for Muslim. Girl Potato said, it's a type of sandwich meat. <laughs> Pokorni said, that's salami. <laughs> Okay, okay. I apparently needed this laugh. Oh my gosh. Aussie girl said, hi Chantel. For me, it's either one or three. I can't decide. They are both delicious. Okay. Um, Willie Rot said, toad in a hole or puddle pie would be nice. Or even spotted dick. I think you've already made the others. Are those similar to shit on a shingle? I don't know. I've never heard of any of that. Um, Danger, Danger Roddy that person said all three treat yourself are you serious all three treat yourself that's all she does is treat herself she never says no to herself you must be a feeder i'm not even trying to be mean all three all three you must hate her trash pandy 88 said come on people vote for the big mac lol i want to see this trisha said curry goat and rice mm, please send me some oh and masla lol Amelia said, why not something a bit healthier? I'm liking that. Let's look at the reply. Veronica said, boring. It might be boring, but if you want to continue to see her eat, like you're going to want to suggest some healthy things or she slows down because at the rate she's going, I don't know how many mukbangs we have left. That's not me trying to be mean. That's me stating facts. Um, Cherie said, I'd love to see a homemade Big Mac. Ugh. <sighs> Let's look at newest comments. Okay, I think we read them all, you guys. I will keep a lookout for Foodie's vlog. Um, I'm hoping we can go live to cover it, so I hope to see you then. I hope you're having a great day, great evening, wherever you are. Have a beautiful weekend, an amazing holiday. Make great memories, make good choices, and I will see you, I'm sure, so soon. Bye, you guys.